All right, guys, I'm going to do a quick video here on how I prep my belts for tooling. So I've got my belt blank cut here. I've cut it to the right length. So that's the cut length. And like I said, I usually do that. Their belt bend to a hole measurement, um, adding 10 and a half inches. So now I'm just putting a mark there at 7 inches because that's where the fold's going to be. So we don't need any stiffener there. We're not going to tool that area. And then I've just got pieces of poster board. And this poster board here, I usually cut mine inch and an eighth. Um, and I use that across the board, even if it's an inch and three quarter belt or something, but you can make it wider on your wider belts. But then I just tip the uh, end of it there so it fits my belt tip. And then I'm gonna put some glue on here. And um, I just use my contact cement. I guess you can use rubber cement if you want. Um, it doesn't really matter, just something to get that glued on. We're not gonna remove the stiffener on this belt after we get done tooling it. We're just gonna leave it in there. It's gonna, um, one it's hard hard to get it off of there and two it'll kind of add a little bit of uh, stiffness or body to your belt um, along with also keeping them from stretching and you can use tape for this if you if you don't like having paper inside there you and then right here we're just going to add our another little piece because it wasn't quite long enough up to our seven inch mark leaving it out of our bend area and so as you can see i want to kind of press that paper down make sure that it sticks really good um, and as you can see, an inch and an eighth gives us a little clearance there, so you don't see that paper along the edge. And then I've got my other piece here. I'm going to go to our seven inch mark. I usually like to overlap. Um, if you butt it up, you'll have a little, you can almost sometimes feel that break in there, so I like to overlap that paper. I'm going to do the same thing after we get that first one glued on, is we'll just put some glue on both pieces. Um, and you don't need to use a lot of glue. It's paper to leather, so it's going to stick really well. You can do just a really light, thin coat. Um, and just enough to get it to stick and you could probably use a spray adhesive if you wanted to I'm gonna let that dry just a little bit and come back and stick that right on where we want it and that's it just glue that down and then your belts prepped and you can case it up and tool it and it shouldn't stretch on you thank y'all